What's up guys, welcome back to another video, and today we are going to be trying something really cool today. I've already played it and I was pretty mind blown because I didn't even think this existed. Mr. Dreamcast over here showed me this freaking cool thing because I got a CD burner today for my PC from one of my friends and a few CDs to no, use. Fellas. I was talking, but sorry. okay. <laughs> oh, sorry. But uh, anyway. I thought you were going to stop and it just, yeah. <laughs> no, but no, I got a I got a CD burner today from one of my friends and uh, gave me some blank CDs and Mr. Dreamcast over here recommended I should burn Sonic 1 for PS1. I was like, what? That exists? I knew that it existed for Super Nintendo. And again, just like the Super Nintendo version, it's only one stage. I actually did not know about this and I don't know actually, if you guys know about it either, but yeah. To an extent, it also exists for NES to an extent. Yeah, true. And it sucks. But uh, yeah, um... From what I was told, this actually has not been tested on real hardware either, and I'm using real hardware, as you can probably tell by my Elgato software and by the quality. I mean, I'd imagine, I mean, I'd imagine it'd be tested on Reddit by some random fuck, like, years ago. Like, uh, uh, actually, no, it only released last year, but from what I know, there's no videos of it on real hardware. This will be the first one. Yeah, and uh, I wanted to show you guys how it works on real hardware. Uh, it's only one stage. It's Green Hills on Act 3, but enough of my rambling and shit. Let's actually get into it. Plus, it's going to already take a while for my PS1 to read this because i got to go into my memory card and wait for the hacking to get done. And if you're wondering how I got my PS1 hacked, I got a special memory card um, that a, 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 um, also a friend sent me. It was like an eBay listing or something. It was like a $10, uh, $10 memory card. It was either 10 or 20 I forgot. But it was totally worth it, because I can play, like, any region, like, disc, and I can also play burnt CDs. So this is how I play my yeah. burnt CDs and shit, so I didn't have to mod chip my PS1, because I have, like, no soldering skills at all. But, uh... So finally, a video on actual real hardware instead of Sonic Origins. Yeah. Right now my PS1 looks like a Commodore game, because, uh, I don't know. <laughs> no, <laughs> this is, this remind actually, given the strings, this actually really reminds me of the Amstrad CPC-464. The what? The Amstrad CPC four six four. Never heard of that once in my life. Anyway, let, let's just let's get into the game. Yeah, give it a second. Yo, I, I, it was, there we go. Here we go. The music's really good. Yep. There and is no invincibility. There's reflections in the water. Yeah. Whee! The physics are really spot on too. I'll be honest. Why didn't you take the lower path? Because this is faster. And that's the end of the stage. There's no boss or anything, sadly. But we're gonna explore around the stage because, uh, yeah, but that's how I normally play Sonic 1, uh, Green Hill Act 3. But yeah, look at the water. It looks really cool. Yeah, the music's really nice. There's like a skidding sound effect too, like an actual one, not the normal one that's in like every other Sonic game. That's pretty cool. Holy crap, this is cool. Then there's an extra live sound effect, which we will try to showcase again. I'm pretty sure it's from another Sonic game. I forgot what Sonic game it was, though. I know I played Let's it. Let us know in the comments. Let us know. Yeah, if I can get to the extra life, I know it's somewhere around here. At least it's on springs. Yeah, I will. I know I heard that somewhere. I don't know where though. Is it possible that it's the master, the early uh, demo version to the track? Maybe, I don't know. I always take the lower path of playing this place, I'm not pussy. There's another life up there, let me get that. There we go. I noticed how the sound effects picks up the monitor breaking, I guess, are uncompressed. Yeah, that's pretty like cool. the Saturn, which couldn't do that. It probably could, they just didn't bother doing it. Arseholes. Ooh, you almost died there. No, the lower part, the lower part. We should actually show them how it looks like to die. Uh, I, I will in a minute. I don't even have the lower path in there. Yeah, here's the lower path. This is really yeah, fucking this is cool. Yeah, this uh, was a demo made uh, last year. So there is a chance, I guess, of this being made into a... Uh, maybe the full game, who knows? I'd love to see it. I would too, but I don't think the one for Super Nintendo is going to be a full game. It was just a test demo, I believe. 
Uh, oh yeah, when you lose your rings, it's like Sonic Mania, it like goes in front of the screen and shit. Cool. Oh, you should have looked down by the super monitor. It's cool. I don't even think the camera moves down. I don't know. Just show up, show up the trick. Oh yeah, the trick. Oh yeah, when you try to pause the game or the press the start button, you can like fly around and shit because obviously this isn't finished, but uh, yeah. That's cool. And you can also break shit doing it too, and also when you like try to die, you can't really die. Or well, I think you can die to an enemy, but like when you like fall Wait, off of, like the stage, like... like... Huh? If I die to spike. I can actually try to- hang on, let me try and die. I can't die, okay. <laughs> I guess you can't die in this game. Uh, I guess by an enemy then. Yeah, even when you like fall down here, you can't die either, so uh... Go get, go get hit by a motorbike. Go get hit by one. If I didn't kill all the enemies, if I can find any, sure. Hang on. Hey! Hey! Oh no! Shit. I need to go back up here. Shoot me! No! Come back! Also, now that Sonic's palette is way more vibrant. Yeah, it's like the Super Nintendo one. Yeah, I don't think you can die in this demo. You can lose rings, but you can't die. The detail though is like really freaking cool though, I'm gonna be honest. Mm -hmm. There's not really a lot. Maybe what you maybe what you could do in the future is just do a video of Sonic 1 on the console. Yeah. Like uh, you could do the Sonic 1 GBA ROM That's better than the actual freaking Sonic 1 on GBA, Sonic Genesis. Yeah, and it's made by stealth too. You should call it Sonic Genesis because it's fucking dog shit. Yeah, you probably should. You should do a, when you do your Sonic One playthrough, you should play that version. Talk to yourself. Well, that's kind of it, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I really wanted to show this off to you guys on real hardware and like uh, Mr. Dreamcast. I don't think it's been shown off on real hardware before. So, uh, yeah, thank you guys so much for tuning in and watching. For more content like this, consider dropping a subscribe. Uh, and I will see you guys later. And uh, don't do drugs.